Hi, I'm Dan Hargrove of Glendale's Public Works Department. Glendale is a community which recognizes its trees as one of our most valuable public resources. The preservation of our community forest is one of our citizens' highest priorities. It is for this reason that we have enjoyed a long-term partnership with our residents and business owners in caring for our city trees. The statewide drought in California has had a negative impact on our community forest. The ongoing drought conditions have placed many of our street, park, and private landscape trees in a state of environmental stress that have allowed these trees to become much more susceptible to attack from pests and diseases, which take advantage of weakened trees. Ips bark beetle, fungal, and canker diseases have already taken a toll on a number of our pines and redwoods and parks and along our city streets. Shot hole borer and gold spotted oak borer are two other devastating pests that have been found in and around Glendale that pose a significant threat to our oaks, sycamores, and other species. The value of preserving our community trees far outweighs the cost of properly watering them. With new state water restrictions and continued drought conditions, many may be confused about how to water and care for our trees. During periods of drought, it is essential to keep trees watered, but the amount of watering required to keep your trees healthy is surprisingly low. Here are some tips for caring for your trees during the drought. The key is less frequent, low and slow, deep watering within the tree's drip line. That's a space underneath the tree within the edge of its canopy. Allowing this area to soak to a depth of about two to three feet is optimal to proper watering. Young and newly planted trees should be deep watered once every 10 to 14 days. For more mature trees, a deep soaking two times per month is enough to keep them healthy. For oaks and other Mediterranean climate trees, a deep watering once per month is sufficient to keep them thriving. Drip irrigation. A soaker hose with timers and tree watering bag systems are ideal for deep watering. To irrigate by hand, turn on the hose to a low, even flow rate and allow the water to cover the area around the tree for 15 to 20 minutes, being sure to soak the soil rather than allowing the water to run off. For younger trees, a four to six inch watering basin around the drip line filled with mulch can help capture and control this deep watering. Be sure, however, you don't pile the mulch around the trunk of the tree as it can invite disease as well. To help with your drought watering efforts, the city provides a free mulch program to our residents. Mulch piles are regularly available to the public to utilize at various locations in our city parks. Finally, when trees are coping with drought conditions, avoid fertilizing them or adding to the environmental stress by over pruning them. Minimize trimming to cleaning out any dead wood and very light structural work such as necessary removal of broken or crossing branches. Together we can conserve water while still preserving our community forests. For more information, visit glendaletrees.org.